Hey what's up everyone, so welcome back to another video. So you want to get the new look of the Pixels, the new Google phone, but you don't have the money to buy the, the new Google phone. Today I'm gonna show you how to get a close look to the new Pixels with a launcher. The steps are very easy, don't need to install new ROMs, don't need to have root, just very easy simple steps. Of course you'll not get the functions of the new Pixels, but you're gonna get at least the look of it. And yeah, let's check it out. Okay, so let's start straight from the beginning and I'm gonna delete the launcher that I have already installed as I showed you in the intro. Uh, I'm gonna try to del delete the cache and uh, to uninstall the launcher that I have so you can guys see uh, from the beginning uh, how I install it and how I change the settings or which settings do you need to, cha to change because there are some tweaks to change on the launcher after you install it. Let's just uh, delete the cache uh, and uninstall it. And once uninstalled, I'm gonna go to my home because I don't have an, another launcher installed. Uh, but I have the icons already installed from the store, which I'm gonna show you later. But uh, that I forgot to to uh, uninstall and uh, uninstall them again. So you just type on Google uh, Nova Launcher 5 Beta 6. It's important to be Beta 6. And then you download it from where you want. But I found from APK, APK Mirror. Uh, dot com that it works uh, more than fine. I mean, the download uh, is fast, and there is no like uh, third-party downloads and stuff like that from like from another websites. When you do download something, there comes a bunch of other apps to download. Uh, this one's this one is just straightforward, but it's up to you. Uh, you can you do can download it from where you want. Uh, once uh, downloaded, it's not the, the file is not big. Just press on it and install it. Uh, but if you might get a warning that it's you can't uh, install it, just go into settings and in security and then there is an option where uh, it says um, to, al to allow unknown sources, which this one, it's also an unknown source because I'm installing it through an APK and not uh, directly uh, from the store and it's already downloaded, just choose Nova Launcher and it will start this Nova Launcher. At the beginning when you start it, uh, the, the start, the, all the applications they don't appear, uh, they will appear after some time, <laughs> now they are appeared. Um, and the, the app drawer, uh, it's more or less like the same as on uh, Pixels, but the start home, it's not the same, so here we need to do some tweaks. Uh, but like I mentioned, uh, you have to install the icons, if you want to, the icons to be as also uh, like on the on the pixels, uh, you just need to install this pixel pixel icon pack, and uh, it's free. That's why I choose this one. It's free and it's more or less close to the pixels, which I actually also forget to show you in this video how to change how to change them. But there is an option in the in the launcher itself to change the icon pack. But once you install it, it's pretty easy. You just go and look and feel. And there is an option to change the, the icons, which I forgot to show that. And here the search bar, as you can see, I don't I have the normal search bar. Uh, you have to have this search bar on the home screen. And once you have it, just come here, uh, search bar. And as you can see, when you choose difference, it changes as well. And you can, as you can see, also there is a preview. Uh, we want to choose the small one on the left and to be black as well. Um, now it's white, but it's possible to make it also black. Now it's still white, but let's go into settings again. Uh, you go in, you go in desktop, search bar style, and there is bar color, which I was having some hard time to find it. But there is bar color, and you choose the color you want. As you can see, it changes already. Uh, we're gonna choose this dark grayish, uh, which looks also like on the pixel. Also the white, there is the white one, but uh, I like more the, the dark one. And there is more settings to, ch to change. Uh, on the apps uh, and widgets, uh, you can choose here how you want to be the apps, the app PP drawer, uh, to be vertically or horizontally. Uh, this one, it, the look is more from uh, the previous uh, Androids, but vertically uh, it's from the new pixels, which some might like this vertical, some might like horizontal so the, at least you have the option to choose which one you want and I also don't like the background on the app drawer to be fully white so I may I like to make it a bit transparent 
but for now let's just try to select there's the search bar you can see now at the top you have the search search apps but i don't really like that so i want to to have the like the apps and then the search uh, which uh, you just need to and here is the uh, transparent uh, settings uh, i don't really like so much transparent because kind of looks not so good so i like to put like 10 15 percent uh, transparency just press uh, yes and it will apply that disable the search bar and enable the tab bar so it will be like uh, you can see the apps and the search icon and the settings icon at the top which i like like this more uh, there is as you can see there is still a bit of transparency but not too much transparency uh, but there is still one missing uh, thing on the desktops uh, which is a small white square at the bottom which to enable it just go again into settings <laughs> this is always to go into settings and go into go into the dock and here as you see at the bottom the preview choose the rectangle one and the transparency you choose also as, as much as you want but you have to select the option draw behind the navigation bar and as you can see when I enable disable it goes behind the navigation bar as well choose the color which on the pixels the color is white and a transparency choose as much as you want i'd like to have 50 percent 60 percent and that's more or less about it it's a, an easy trick to install um, not very complicated of course you don't have the the features of the pixels like i mentioned but just the look and also with these launchers i kind of lost the ability to double touch to turn off the screen as you can see in my main launcher it works to, to turn off the screen uh, but with the nova launcher i lose that ability to turn off i can turn off by by button and i can turn off by double tapping but double tapping to turn off the, the phone it doesn't work thank you guys for watching and i see you on the next one